Okay, so now I'm on to the Atlas GP7. A couple of things to note about this unit. To get the shell off, it's real easy, but you have to disconnect handrails. And I'm going to show you where. Right there, and right there, and also down here. As you can see, this one is loose. Because um, this all separates. Same with the other side. And then it just wiggles off. There's a tab on each end of the hood. And that's basically it. Alright, I'm going to open it up. Made a few modifications here. Not too many, but a few. Okay, this is the inside of a classic line uh, Atlas GP7 with LEDs. One of the things that they did with this, and it's going to make it harder to make the LEDs really bright, is they have very long tubes, light tubes in here, as you can see. Um, which, unfortunately, the longer the tube, the more the light kind of dissipates through it with these LEDs. But it's not bad. I'll live with it. Also, what I did was you'll notice that I added weight one quarter ounce on each side front and back in these areas here there's plenty of room if it's tight to the roof of the shell you'll have no problem and I also did it there too so that added an extra ounce of weight I probably could have done more but I really don't want to push my luck it is kinda of tight in here um, if they did something different with the light you could put weight in this area here but I'm like, eh, it's good enough. It's pretty heavy because this is all casted, the walkways. So it is pretty heavy. I added a little more to it, so an ounce more. So anyway, that is the Atlas GP7 decoder install.